Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how I achieved this look right here. For the holidays, I actually wanted to play with a lot of reds and maroons and you know basically I just wanted something that would be really vampy yet beautiful and I'm very happy with how this makeup look turned out to be. I hope you guys also enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and let's get into it. So, I've already got my moisturizer on. For moisturizer, I've used the WOW Skin Science Hyaluronic Acid Water Gel. So, now I'll be directly jumping in into color correcting. For color corrector, I'm going to go in with the LA Pro Conceal Color Corrector in the shade Orange. And now I'll be blending that with a damp beauty blender. Alright, now I'll be jumping into foundation. For foundation, I'm gonna use the Maybelline Superstay foundation in the shade uh, Sun Beige. And I'm gonna be blending that with the damp beauty blender. Now moving on to concealer, for concealer I'm going to be using these two concealers right here. I'm going to be mixing the Maybelline AJ Wine Concealer in the shade Honey and I'm going to be mixing the LA Pro Conceal Concealer in the shade Pure Beige. I'm going to be placing them under my under eyes. And now I'll be setting my under eyes with this translucent setting powder from Blue Heaven. Okay, so I'll do my eyebrows and be right back. Okay, now moving on to the eyes, I'm going to prime my eyelids with some concealer. Just going to take a little bit of concealer on this flat brush and place it on my eyelids. And now I'm going to set my lids with some translucent setting powder. You can also go in with the nude eyeshadow. Okay, so now I'm going to be using this shade right here. And I'm going to be using this fluffy blending brush which I got from Amazon. And I'm going to be placing this color on my crease. And I'm going to be using it as my transition shade. I'm also going to drag it all the way to my outer corners as well as my inner corners. Okay, so now for the next shadow, I'm going to be going in with this red shade right here. And I'm going to be using this flat brush and placing it on my eyelid. Now that I've got the red color placed down, I'm going to go in with this dark brown shade right here and place it between the transition shade and the red shade. Now I'm taking a little bit of black eyeshadow and placing it exactly where I placed the dark brown. Okay. 
Now I'm going to go back with the same brown shade and place it to diffuse the black. Now I'm going to go back in with that red shade to get more intensity. Alright, now moving on to eyeliner, I'm going to use the Inglot Gel Eyeliner and just do a wing. Now to highlight my inner corners, I'll be taking a silver highlighter shade, a silver eyeshadow basically. Now for my lower lash line, I'll be going in back with this transition shade right here. Now that I've got that place down, I'm going to be going in with this shade as well. Also taking a little bit of black. And now to line my lower lash line, I'm going to go in with the K Beauty Kajal in the shade Spade and just line my waterline. Alright, now to finish off the eye look, I'll just place some falsies and be right back. Alright, now I'm just going to apply a little bit of mascara to my lower lash line. Alright, now I'm going back in with that silver shade that I used to highlight my inner corners and I'm slightly gonna highlight my brow bone. Alright, now moving on to the face, I'm gonna contour my face with these two products right here. I'm gonna go in with this purple compact powder in the shade That Special Bait Relationship 2 and I'm gonna go in with the Wet n Wild Contour Palette Powder in the shade Caramel Toffee. I'm gonna mix both these shades together and contour my face. Okay, now moving on to blush, I'm going to use the Maybelline Cheeky Glow Blush in the shade Fresh Coral. Alright, and now for highlighter, I'm going to use my Champagne Shimmer Brick Highlighter and just highlight my face. Alright, now that the face is complete, let's move on to the lips. For lips, I'm going to line my lips with this maroon lip liner. And for lipstick, I'm going to go in with this maroon liquid lipstick. And this is the finished look. This look is perfect for the holidays. This look has a nice dramatic and vampy feel to it. I hope you guys really enjoyed watching this video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. You can also follow me on my social media such as Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat and Facebook. Thank you so much for watching guys and I will see you all in the next one. Bye bye.